Hey everyone, it's Sarada and I scribble and today I will be drawing my witch Sona and I will also be using an array of different pastel-y looking mediums. I have my Stettler Kara Aquarel pencils, I have Posca pens, I have my Sakura Souffle pens because I really love those. I have a white Signo and I have some liners which I'm going to use because it is Inktober. So I'm using the art line to line this drawing. I just find it the most, it's the thinnest one I have and it's the easiest to use. Um, and I really should be using my favorite castel one so I can buy a new one, but I don't want to because it's difficult. Either way, my witch Sona is a laundry witch and she is a laundry witch because I really love doing laundry. Yeah, no joke. I have. Like, doing laundry is rewarding for me. I find it very rewarding. Like, if I do something, like, if I have to do something I don't want to do, uh, I get through that by telling myself, when you're done, you get to go downstairs and fold some laundry or load up a machine or just... I really like laundry. Um, I used... Uh, the Stettlers to start out with. I used that for the skin. Um, I don't know, I just really wanted to use uh, basically almost everything I had traditional media wise. And um, uh, I just like mixing the sort of textured look of color pencils with uh, the more solid look of the Posca paint markers and uh, the Sakura Souffles. Uh, by the way, the Sakura Souffles, they are so pretty. Like, no joke, they are so pretty to use because I, I, I can like sit and stare and watch them dry and just see the color change. It's, it's really pretty. Yeah, I mainly used the color pencils as much as I could. And then on some other parts, I stuck in the more solid color materials. I actually haven't planned very well for this week. I, I'm i scrambling a little uh, and it's kind of scary because I was well prepared for both week one and two, but this week I just didn't really have the time to prepare. So I do know what I'm doing from day to day. Like I prepare the night before for the next day, but uh, I don't have the entire week planned out. So I'm a little bit scared I might miss a day if I'm uninspired and just don't feel like doing stuff, so uh, I'm gonna try and plan a little bit better and uh, I don't know, I haven't felt very creative either so um, I think that might be a reason why uh, I haven't really prepared anything uh, because doing art like this every day uh, while it helps you be consistent and productive it can also drain you quite a lot in the creative manners uh, however yesterday I did draw up a really pretty sketch like I'm super proud of it so that is what I'll be doing for tomorrow's video and I'm really excited for it because it turned out really nice here you can see the socks they were sakura souffle and that is such a bright color same with the ice cream on the t-shirt that is also the sakura souffle the colors are just so incredibly bright and they mix really well with the Poscas too. Like th they um, turn out, like they, they have sort of the same texture. Though the souffle rolls, they do turn out kind of shiny once they dry. I noticed that while I was checking the stuff in the light. So for my witch Sona, I went with a pretty modern look. Um, I gave her a wand because I feel like a wand is necessary. Um, and uh, I also gave her the apron. Uh, I don't know if it's a Scandinavian thing, but I feel like witches uh, have aprons, so I gave her one of those. It actually sort of mirrors the apron I sometimes use when I'm doing laundry, so yay consistency! Um, what else? Yeah, I've seen so many other people's witches and wizards, warlocks, and there's so many different ones. Like, it's really cool to see what uh, witch type of uh, drawing people do, like if they go for the more classic look with a hat and everything, or if they stay with uh, a modern style. It's really cool to see. 
Uh, oh, I'm working on the bubbles right now. Yeah, the bubbles. I have an another piece of artwork where I'm doing bubbles, so I wanted to practice on this one. I kind of wish I had actually used the souffle rolls on the bubbles because the black liner, while it turned out looking nice, uh, I feel like the black is contrasting too heavily to like the rest of the colorful aspect of the picture. So uh, I think I should have used like more rainbow uh, type of uh, colors and done a few different colors for all the bubbles, but. Uh, they turn out looking pretty nice. I also added sparkles because clean clothes, they sparkle when you hang them on the line. Uh, either way, I'm finished. Here are some of the tools I used. And here you can see the picture more cleaned up. I actually edited it a little bit. Uh, it was a little bit unbalanced and I also moved the head of uh, my witch Sona because, I don't know, she was craning her neck too much. Anyway, I'll see you again tomorrow for Inktober. Bye!